Despite efforts by health authorities to eradicate Buruli ulcer in the country, the Shanti region still remains one of the Buruli ulcer endemic areas in the country. The Amansia Central District runs third in the national infection rate. Neighboring Amansia West District is also a Buruli ulcer endemic area. It is to reduce the incidence of the disease in the district that the Department of Biochemistry, Cell and Molecular Biology at the University of Ghana and the West Africa Center for Cells Biology of Infectious Pathogens organized a training program for community health workers in the district. They were taken through how samples can be taken to be tested for the Borrelial bacteria in the laboratory. <laughs> The Amansia Central District Director of Health, Mr. Chumese Mensa, said the training is timely because there is a need to disseminate information on the disease to prevent its spread. The remote areas where nobody goes to, we hope that this training will help those who are working in those areas to be able to identify the cases and also get solutions to them, solution the fact that you will get um, medication to manage them. Dr. Lydia Mosi of the Department of Biochemistry, Cell and Molecular Biology at the University of Ghana said there is a need to step up efforts to eradicate Bruley ulcer in the country. The work that we are doing as part of this training is to try and collect as many samples as we can, we can find and look in the samples for key things that will help us or advise us on how to get a very easy diagnostic. If treatment of Borrelli ulcer is delayed, surgery, skin grafts, extensive wound care and physical therapy may be needed to lessen the debilitating effect of the disease.